All right, there they are. There's the little buddies. There's four of them. They're named Jessica, 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 and Kevin. That's too many. One's named Kevin. What Use vehicle bay. What is up the world? It is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here. Hanging out today, doing stuff and things. Playing some more Subnautica peeps. Welcome Hope you guys are having a good day. Active. I'm having a great day. Thanks so much for coming to hang out with me today, guys. Thanks so much for showing some pretty amazing support on the Subnautica series. Make sure if you like the video, continue to support it. Please don't forget, smash the thumbs up button to show your support. And if you're new and you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well. All right, so last time we built the worst little tiny base of all time. Because, I mean, they've taken away the, uh, the multi-purpose room was the name of the thing that I couldn't remember from the last time. You can't just build the multi-purpose room to start off with. You need to, to find it. You need to scan it. So we also, there's a bunch of things that we need to find that we just can't find without going around and doing some stuff and things. So let's go ahead and take a look here. Uh, like so. So even some of the stuff like the sea glide, we have to find stuff and things to scan that. Now we have a couple, oh yeah, we got a new message too. We have a couple of signals Right here from Life Pod 4, 880 meters away. Life Pod 3 is only 507 meters away. We have another signal. It's down inside of the base, and we have another transmission. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora, do you read? Over. Yeah, we're here, Avery Quinn. Still nothing. What? These old Terra ships. They've run out of engine grease. They send an SOS. You offer to help? They don't pick up. Well, Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. Come it's to the close side of the system. More than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Yes. Over. Yes. I'll SOS. Try them again tomorrow. See what the long range scan picks up in the meantime. Damn charter's gonna have us wasting our profit margin running errands for Altera. Yeah, it's all about your profit margin, stupid jerk. That's all anybody cares about is their profit margin, not human life, not the environment. All right, so, whoa, that's the 508 meter one. Let's check the other signal. I feel like we need to find out what's going on. We need to get a sea glide. This signal says crew report their sea glide damage. So that might not be a bad place to just try to swim over to. Let's see inside of here. Let's go ahead and grab this signal. Let's remove one. Oh, I don't know which one's what, which. Oh yeah, crew request assistance with survival radiation. Let's take that one and squirt it in. That's 680 meters away. And then we have the sea glide one over here. So I think just to start off today, we're gonna go ahead and head over. I'm just gonna swim it. I mean, well, you know what we should do first before we go? We should get a little bit of food going. We actually, we have our nutrient block. I kind of wanted to save the nutrient block because it doesn't seem to spoil. Um, but we do need to get some hot water action up in this piece, which means I need to get some air bladders. There's one right there. You need to get a couple of air bladders. Oh, you want to go? Give me that air bladder. Where there's one air bladder, there's only one air bladder. Normally, there's like more than one. All right. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to go ahead and get a couple bladders, get some water going so that we can just make the trip over there. It's only 400 meters away now. Well, we'll just get prepared. Come here. No, no, no. Where, where'd your buddy go? Wow, they swim fast, these little bladders. Bladder fish. They, I think I call them air... Whoa. Cut cream by when I... I call them air bladders. I think they used to be called air bladders. I can't remember now. I'm going to go ahead. Like I said, I'm going to make up some water. Ooh, and we're going to swim over there and see if they've got a sea glide that we can scan. All right. We're about halfway there. I'm, I'm a little bit concerned. You know, normally in Subnautica... You get a sea glide right away. You're definitely more mobile earlier on. Where's my knippy? Can I have my knife back, please? Thank you. Uh, you're more mobile earlier in the game. So this is kind of weird to like leave the life pod on foot, so to speak, and go this far out um, without anything in case we need to escape. I don't really s s think there's anything we need to escape from necessarily, but it's still just feels weird to me and kind of exciting at the same time so let's go ahead and head up all right let's go down inside of here and see what we can see let's get our scanner out 
It's been a while since I've scanned anything. Oh, we got a PDA. LifePod 3 clue, crew log. Okay, we can't get inside of there. We can't do anything with this. There's nothing to scan. There's no sea glide here. Oh, wait. What is this? Open data box. Well, this is new. Open data box. High capacity tank. Additional air capacity. Oh, baby. That's cool. So it gave us like a blue. Oh, you want to go? Okay, so... Oh, there's a sea glide right there. Okay. So how many do we need to scan? One of two. So we got half of the sea glide fragments that we need, but not the entire thing. So we need to find another sea glide fragment. That was kind of neat. They were, they've definitely made some major improvements, man. They've made some major changes. I just want to continue to take a look around here to make sure I'm not missing anything. I don't think that I am, but I just want to double check. And it used to be long, long ago as well. There were sea glide fragments kind of all over the place. I have not seen anything like that. So I'm not sure if they've kind of, I don't know if I can get over to there. I don't know if they've kind of uh, changed how the fragment system works. If there are less now, or how that works. It kind of used to be that you could just find fragments, like, all over the place. There was a bunch. Um, I'm not really seeing anything around me right now. I figure we're close enough to this. Oh, you know what? Let's head back. Let's head back and take a look before we go there, because that looks kind of deep. And I'm kind of scared. Oh, there's an infected guy. So, I'm going to head back to base, keeping an eye... Oh, oh, that's a, that's a bigger egg. So, this is a, for those of you who have never seen one, this is a bigger creature egg. We can grab it. We might as well just grab that. So, what I'm thinking that we're going to do is head back to the base. Is that another creature egg? No, it's just a deposit of seven things. Not really gathering up materials right now. Um, and get a look at building that higher capacity air tank. Because I think that's going to be essential if we're going to go anywhere that's any deeper. Um, and we really need to find the sea glide too. That would also help us to go deeper. Oh, mobile vehicle bay fragment. One of three. What is this deal? Nothing. What are you? A box. It's definitely seems to get darker here now. Trash can scan. What's our O2 doing? Oh, man. This takes a long time. Holy crap. That's it. Trash can. We can build it. All right. Let's head up for some air real quick. Before we head out of this area, I think it's worth just taking another cursory look around. See if there are any other fragments. Oh, right there. Mobile vehicle fragment. And the fragments look different now. Two of three. So those two fragments were different. There's the trash can. Oh. Writhing weed. Let's just scan a bunch of stuff. Why wouldn't we? Alien life forms. I don't even remember this being a thing. Oh. We got a seed. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. I'm trying to see if there's another mobile... Whoa. Acid mushrooms. We haven't scanned it yet. I was trying to see if there's another mobile vehicle bay fragment deal in the area, but I don't see one. All right. Heading back to the life pod. We're back very close to the base. I found another sea glide fragment, and I do believe this is all we're gonna need. Nailed it, Ace Gaby. Stop. Sea glide. I scanned a bunch of stuff. The gastropod? Wait, I already scanned you. Yeah, you're scanned, homie. So I scanned a bunch of stuff and things on my way back. Just anything that it was showing me that I needed to. Just like acid mushrooms, some of the other wildlife, some of the fish, and stuff and things like that. I got those all scanned in. I don't think we're gonna worry too much about base stuff until we get the multi-purpose room. Um, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I guess we could just build it out of tunnels, but it feels weird. We also had a new transmission. Aurora, this is Sunbeam again. We just picked up a massive debris field at your location. I didn't know how bad. Uh, yeah, how we're, of, everyone's dead but me, dude. I didn't know. We're now en route to your location. We're going to okay. bring you home. Okay, good. Sunbeam out. Thank you. 
What else can I say? We're a six-seater. We aren't even slightly <laughs> equipped to handle this. What? Our pilot last attempt at a planet landing in the Academy Simulator. Oh, it's a bad situation. <laughs> so are all the alternatives. You forgot your push to talk was on, buddy. So, all right. Uh, inside of here now, we grabbed... I think I can't remember one bladder, maybe two. Just so we have a little bit of hot water action, and we had a Gary fish in there too. Wait, uh, 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 and a peeper. So I just want to cook these guys up real fast, then we'll take a look at what kind of stuff we're gonna need in order to build stuff and things. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and just uh, eat a you and a delicious, and then one of these, and let's fill it up all the way. Bam! They ladies came. Stop! I grabbed a little bit of quartz on the way back too. We gotta to squirt this egg somewhere. Yeah, you're fine. All right, so inside of here now, the uh, stuff and things that we can build, the O2 tank is there. Fire extra. So I don't know if we can build the better O2 tank until we get... I can't remember what it is. It's a higher tier machine. The Sea Glide. Battery, lubricant, copper wire, titanium. All right. Titanium. Easy. No problem at all. Battery, uh, copper wire. You know what? We've got copper wire down here. Or copper, pardon me, down here. No, open. So, copper right there for copper wire. No, I don't want to rename it. And then... I'm not sure what else we're going to need in order to build the computer chips up. Let's grab a couple of these. I think we might need them. And then a couple of these. Just in case. Let's head back up here and see... We're going to need gold. Oh, yeah, that's right. We're going to need to find more gold. All right. So inside of this guy, like so. Copper wire. Uh, uh, bam. Nailed it. Is the camera stopped? All right. And we're going to need to do a battery, which we had all the stuff to build a second ago. We just need one more copper ore in order to get that going. Let's go down and pick that guy up. All right, so now we'll have that. I keep getting alerts on stuff like I've never seen copper wire before. We have some stuff in the data bank, too. I'm going to take a look at that here in a second. We found that one data recorder. Let's go inside of here again. Uh, 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 battery. And then I'm so surprised we don't need a computer chip. We need lubricant. Uh, wait. Right there. Creep vine seed clusters times three. So let me gather those up. Might take me a second. All right, guys. So we're ready to make lubrican. I think. There we go. I got enough so we can make a couple. Oh, it comes in a bottle. Well, it would, wouldn't it? So we've got our hot lubrican action. Sea glide, baby. Oh, do we have enough room? We might not have. Yeah, yeah. I cleared out a bunch of room. We should be good to go. Unless they made a humongous. All right, sweet. So we have our sea glide nailed. That he's the cave stop. I can tell you straight away. We're gonna need. Another battery, two acid mushrooms and copper ore. Okay, now I gotta try to remember how the stuff and things work here. Oh, it told me something about the sea glide and then that was it. Um, I can't remember if you can toggle stuff. Does it actually say on it? Converts torque into thrust underwater via propeller. One to five, bind quick slot, blah, 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 blah. So, we can now move pretty quick. You can see the battery reading, and then it also shows off, like, the terrain. Um, it has, like, a little terrain map there, which is cool, and it shows where we are. So it's super, super great. Now, the one thing that was kind of always a problem with the sea glide... Well, at first it was great. Then they made it so that the batteries wore out, like, unbelievably fast. Um, and it looks like maybe they changed it around. I think right-click is reload. I'm just trying to test out the batteries. It looks like the batteries are lasting for quite a while. This is really good news. So we're probably always going to want to carry batteries with us moving forward. Oxygen. <gasps> Let's just go up here real quick. So we need two acid mushrooms and one piece of copper ore in order to get another battery. No, 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 no. Oh, God. You know what? I'll tell you what. This thing needs to get fixed, man. It's, it's, it's just a pain in the butt. Uh, let's squirt our sea glide here. Let's take this and oh, it already squirted there. Let's put that inside of that slot, and then we'll swim up a little bit and we'll release that bad boy. It's super hard to switch or to choose between edit locker, open storage, and pick up. It's very, very small. 
you know, uh, the difference between each one of those options. All right, so the copper more two copper or two acid mushrooms. Um, I have some crap in here I don't really want. Let's just see. I did it again. I even tried to slow down. There we go. So these can go in there. Uh, those we can put up top. We have lubricant. We can squirt the table coral back in. Uh, I'm keeping that. Keep drinking that. All right. Inventory management check. So we'll put the quartz up inside of here. Inside of our base area place. Like I so. said. Squirting it in. Enjoy. Bam. Bam. Extra battery now that he's can't be stopped. So we... All right. So we have some hot mobile action now. We're ready to get some stuff and things done. Now, I changed out our deals. Uh, we have the Life Pod Zero or Life Pod 4 and Life Pod 6 now. I took the other one and put it away since we already explored that. 600 meters away. We should be able to get there much more quickly now with our amazing Sea Glide. And we should be able to surface and get to the bottom much more quickly as well. Look at this, man. We're making great time. And we're back. Oh. Oh, radiation sounds are coming. But it's a reef back. Oh, oh, we're getting radiated. But there's reef backs. I want to see them with you guys. We're losing health. We're losing health. There they are. Isn't that cool? I'm willing to lose some health. Oh, what the hell? Oh, it's got like stuff on it now. Oh, we're hurt real bad. Ooh, we're hurting real bad. Okay, we got to get out. We got to get out of here. We cannot go here until we get a radiation suit. Oh, wow. We're really hurt still. You can see the little, like, 30 seconds. stuff and things on the edge of the screen there. So it looks like this is as close as we can go. Mm, we can't see the reef back. That sucks. Oh, is that another fragment? <gasps> Hold on. Okay. Oxygen. Oxygen. Yeah, baby. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. Sweet. That's it. We got it. Oh, another one. Why don't we just scan? I think this gives us titanium. Yeah, so if you find additional fragments, it gives you it gives you additional titanium. So we can't go over there until we build the radiation suit deal. Let's go ahead up. Let's use this guy. Oh, whoa, whoa. Accidents happened. Oh, where did it go? There it is. Okay, we're back. We're good. Um, I can't remember. Yeah, you can turn the light on and off. I think. I thought it was C. No, C goes down. X, Z, Q, E. No, E just puts it away. I didn't know that. That's cool. So E just puts the guy away. So I'll figure out the keys here in a second. It might be in our PDA. It might tell us inside of there um, what they are. But, yeah, we've got to take a trip back here, check out the mobile vehicle bay, see what we're going to need to get that going, and... Water, water, water. You can't get away from me. Oh, man, I got him right by the throat! So we got to head back, uh, check out the mobile vehicle bay, see what that's going to cost us. The, um... The O2 tank is, um, crafted in the modification station. So we're not ready to get that going yet. But here, okay, titanium ingot. And a power cell. I don't even know. Power cell. Two batteries and silicone rubber. We already have the silicone rubber. We can actually get this going. Jeez, I don't know how much time we have left. What time is it? Let's look outside. Oh, it's getting to be nighttime. Let's see what we can get done. And we're back. So, I checked the data logs for how to turn the light off on the Sea Glide. It used to be that you could turn it off to save battery life. I think that they changed it or removed it. it. I actually even checked the wiki, and it wasn't in there either. Can I switch weapons while I'm climbing? No, I can't. So, I went out and went ahead and grabbed some more titanium. That should be enough to make a titanium ingot. We now have enough stuff. Oh, oh, it's taking a second here. We have enough stuff and things to go ahead and craft a power cell. I got two batteries built. So we're good to go with there with that. We have a message to play too, but there, bam, nail the can't be stopped. Mobile vehicle bay. We're able to do that. Now, can I walk away from that while it's crafting? What happens if we're like far away? So 
So I can just come and pick it up. Okay. So crafting, they added very late in the last season, but it wasn't like a thing. The speeds were, it was all wonky and it wasn't really a thing. So we got oh, a new message. Altera crew, this is LifePod 17. Coordinates attached. Looks like the the forward Seamoth Bay collapsed around me. Do not attempt rescue without laser cutters. You'll only add to the body count. LifePod 17 out. So I'm sure we got a new signal right there. So that's going to be for most likely finding out information about the Seamoth. So let's come up here. Release the vehicle bay. So let's go like this. Oh, do we just do it? Oh, here it is. Okay. So I want to I want to put it out a little bit in a spot that's a little bit deeper. So we'll squirt it right here. And there it is. And it has little buddies on it. It's pretty cool. There they are. Check them out. Oh, they're so amazing. Let's go up here. Oh, we picked it up. Crap. Squirt it back out. Climb. All right. There they are. There's the little buddies. There's four of them. They're named Jessica, 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 and Kevin. That's too many. One's named Kevin. Use vehicle bay. What can we build? Vehicles. Sea moth ingredients unknown. So we don't have the stuff and things in order to do that. We're going to leave the mobile vehicle bay right out there. It won't move around or do anything like that. We shouldn't have a problem with it. Um, uh, yeah, we're making moves, peeps. Stuff and things are happening for sure. Let's pop up inside of here and take a look at what our next stage is. I think we want to take a look at... The radiation suit, fiber, mesh, and lead. The still suit, we don't, we can't build yet. We can do the radiation uh, suit. We have two lead already. I know that fiber, mesh, uh, magnesium, enamel, glass, plate, steel, benzene, synthetic fibers, uranium. Where's the fiber mesh? Computer chip, wiring kit, advanced. Did I miss it? Hold on a second here. Whoa, congratulations, Survivor. You have just exceeded your weekly exercise quotient by 500%. Data indicates that swimming was your favorite activity. Be sure to vary your routine for uniform muscle development. That's good to know. Where's the fiber mesh? Enamel, glass, plate, steel, benzene, synthetic fibers. That uses fiber mesh. This It's got to be... Plasteel, pardon me. Copper wire, battery, power cell, wiring kit, advanced. I'm so confused as to where the fiber mesh is at. Is there another message? We keep bothering me. Message. Tell me. Officer Keen. This is Officer Keen from LifePod 19. Broadcasting to all Aurora crew. The captain is gone. I have assumed command. That means you're the captain. Scans show dry land a kilometer south of the crash site. Stay together and regroup. At the rendezvous point. I know it's rendezvous. Good luck. So we got another signal for dry land as well. Holy crap. This is crazy. I think it's so cool how they've added in all these messages and signals that you get. Um, it feels like it comes at you a little bit fast, though. So if I'm not mistaken, I kind of have played this game before. I'm pretty sure, unless they moved it, dry land is that way. So we can head over there at some point. But really... The first thing we need to do is get the sea glide or sea moth, pardon me. So let's take these guys off. Oh, whoa. It's like right here. Holy crap. 350 meters away, but I have a theory about the fiber mesh and why it's not in my inventory yet. It's made. Yeah, that's it right there. From creep vine samples and I'm sh I'm thinking the reason that we couldn't make the fiber mesh is because we just hadn't gathered up any creep vine samples yet let's see if we are correct yep there it is right there bam nailed these games up super amazing and awesome fiber mesh okay so oh did that unlock other stuff and things rebreather absorbs co2 and recycles it for air at greater depths we need a wiring kit and fiber mesh and the dive reel which Never really has been something that you would use <laughs> too awful much. So now we can make the radiation suit. We need the two lead and a couple more creep vine samples. Let's go ahead and head over here. I also put in the sea moth bay collapsed around them uh, deal right there. It's not very far away. It's pretty close, in fact. So let's just grab a couple more and then one more. Okay, we got it. So then we can just use it. We'll just make a bunch of fiber mesh so we have a huge amount. 
before we go in, we need to grab... Was it just one lead or two? I can't remember. This is starting to become a thing. Oh, inventory full. Crap. We're definitely getting more mobile. The game's progression through each level is getting really cool as far as, like, how you start to get a little bit faster and a little bit faster. It's super neat. So we're just going to craft this all up into fiber mesh. So we have extras. All right, there we go. Come down here. We'll grab our lead. I'm just going to grab two. I can't remember if we had one inside of here or not. Wow, that was fast. All right, sweet. Now we should be able to go in. Bam! Nailed it. It's the KB stop. Radiation suit stuff and things are happening. Let us squirt. Oh, no. It did use two lead. Hmm, glad I came prepared. I think it automatically equipped it all. So I want to squirt this inside of there. Let's go ahead and take a look here. There we go, baby. Radiation helmet, radiation suit, radiation gloves. And we still have our regular swim fins on. So we're doing really good. All right, sweet. We're definitely making moves here, peeps. Uh, a long day's work. Crafting up stuff and things. We need a little bit of hot food action in our lives. We got a couple of peepers to go here. Grab this and grab this guy. Like a so. All right, so let's go ahead and eat. Very hungry. Very hungry. Some water. And we're full. All right, guys. Guess what? That's going to be it for today, peeps. We'll have to move on this signal for LifePod 17 in the next episode. We got the Sea Glide today. We got the Radiation Suit today. We got the Mobile Vehicle Pod today. We definitely made some hot moves in the game. Thanks so much for coming to hang out with me. Make sure if you like the video, please don't forget. Show your support. Smash the thumbs up button. Feel free to share and favorite the videos you see fit. May the stuff and things be with you.